Hey guys, Sir Tap Tap. We're about to play Echo Tone. This is a PC and Mac game that's on. Um, it's on Steam Greenlight, and they're trying to get it approved. This is currently an alpha version. We're gonna try out. Six feet under. Okay, we got a little guy. Reload, like restart. All right. Got X to run. We do not have a jump button, it seems. We got a thing! Oop! Dead. I'm liking the look of the music so far. I guess it's a platformer except, oh god. Oh! Um... Can I climb walls? Push that guy in the pit. Thank you. Your sacrifice was not in vain. There we are. I guess we collect all the little spirits or whatever these white dots are. Okay then. Faith can move mountains. Inspirational quotes the game. Faith! Go faith power! Yeah! Whoa. That is the ugliest fly I've ever seen. Neat. I like the fossils and the This is pretty cool. Up. Oh. There you go. Into the pit. Wee! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Gotta go fast. Whoa. Hey. Excuse you. Hmm. The inability to jump makes it kinda interesting. I feel lighter and keep faith. Can I jump? Yes, I can jump! Oh god, I should probably run. Wait. Did I just, like, hover in the air there? Alright, we're gonna run. And jump, and... Oh god, I can double jump. Okay. That's why I was floating. I think I had a brother. Whoa! Okay, then. Whoop! Dead. This is not the first time I've seen this mechanic in a flash. Yeah, your flash. Um, game. Yeah, I figured this. Come on, take focus. Must be a flash game. It's very vectory. Um, hmm. Bug, no! Didn't I die one time, and he didn't? Like, I didn't reset? Oh man, this... I don't like... I don't like what's going on here. Visually, I like this a lot, and uh, the audio really sells it. The controls, keyboard controls, are kind of not quite precise enough for this, and they're a little slippery. Ah, oh, for friggin'... Wait. Wait. What? I. Fr <sighs> okay, what happened to my double jump? Okay, I've been trying to double jump, and that's apparently part of my problem. Okay, if you're just a bit calmer, that works better. I loved playing with the wind pushing me. Font's just a little bit hard to read. Dead. The soundtrack just gives it this very lonely feel. I kind of dig that. It's... It's funny because the quotes don't really sound like that at all. Jump! 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 Yes! No! Bugs! I hate... Ah, oh, 
I hate bugs so much. The control doesn't feel super tight. I don't know, maybe it's just because I'm using keyboard for a platformer. Keyboard with a platformer, gonna have a bad time. Ah! It's also just that I'm not used to a particular brand of slipperiness going on. It's not super slippery, but it is a little slippery. Ah! I'm sure this would be better with a gamepad, honestly. Um, though it's in Flash, I'm not sure how well that would work. I guess you could map your keyboard keys to it. Your keyboard or your map your gamepad your keyboard keys you have just a bit too much inertia there it's kind of bothersome no too fast good friggin come on I don't see what, why this guy loves playing with the wind pushing him it's Pretty much just a pure nuisance, honestly. And it seems like the... I don't know. Uh, no. Okay. Okay. I'm not sure how we're going to get over this guy. Because the wind... Okay. Okay. We're okay. named him from his dark thoughts once. Named him. Okay. Are we racing? I think I just lost. Oh god. Gotta go fast. Jump! Fire! Oh my god. What was... I was jumping, like, at a neutered height for some reason there. I mean, like, it jumps... You hold h jump longer to jump higher, but... I don't know, it's being kind of weird. I like the spooky eyes. Ah, oh, I have to rate... Oh my god, that's... Hmm. The controls and sort of weird... I don't know if I'm losing frames here, or what, but it feels jerky. I mean, it's an alpha and everything, so, you know. Oh, for frick. I wasn't sure what that was going to do, but I should have really assumed that was going to kill me. Uh, it's a really pretty game, but... Um, the controls don't seem to be quite there, but I mean, I'm sure they'll be better on Steam and everything, and when it's not in alpha more so than all that. I mean, the demos in Flash, I guess Steam games can be, oh my god, can be Flash too. I don't know if there's any performance benefit you can get by not making it, you know, web-based Flash. I have no idea. If that, like, if Flash is just Flash, or if Browser Flash is any slower than, you know, a Flash game you launch from Steam. I don't know if you can optimize that somehow. I'm not a Flash programmer. No! Why are there more? Uh, this level's just a bit too long to be pleasant. I mean, the difficulty ramped up pretty quick here. It's not super long, so I mean, I'm not super annoyed. But, uh. Damn, too early, and they're probably gonna be too late. What the frick? What? See, the I don't like this because it's just memorizing the obstacles, and once you're past the last obstacle that you just learned, there is another screw you obstacle. And you can't take your time because you're racing. Um, it's basically everything I don't like about the old Sonic games, where it was just like, 
you know. You could go fast, but unless you knew exactly what was coming up, um, you're just gonna die, because there's suddenly spikes. I mean, these aren't sp well, they're suddenly bugs with spikes. I, I'm not a fan of that sort of gameplay design. How oh, for f <sighs> Wow, this got really frustrating really fast, I'm sorry. But, honestly. I mean, it looks like it'll be really cool, and I mean... Maybe this will be a later level in the actual game. I want to jump like the obstacles are placed regularly, but... I don't know, I'm just not getting in the flow here. I'll probably call it quits after this level. It looks and sounds really cool, it's a neat world. Um, I hope the levels are mixed up a bit. I like the eyes flowing around and everything, but it'd be nice to see some more variation, but I mean, again, alpha, so I'm sure there'll be more worlds. Uh... Yeah. I don't know quite how to describe it, the controls just feel... I don't know, not quite right. You know, earlier on I was gonna say, oh, maybe if they add a checkpoint, but then I realized, you know, this wasn't this isn't super long. But now, I mean, it's just tedious. Because this th my problem with this sort of game design is that 90% of the level isn't hard. It's just the slam, the door slam of the final like thing. So then you're playing 90% of the level. What? 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 What the fuck was that? Son of a bitch! Now I'm just pissed off. Um, am I supposed to catch him or something? Like, seriously, what the hell? Just death wall at the end of the level after all of that? That is a dick move. I'm sorry. Okay, I touch him. Is that what's going on here? Okay, that, that would have been nice to know. Okay, that was the end. Yeah, you might have gathered I didn't like that last level. But, aside from that... I just want to rant on that. The game design of that last level... Levels like that aren't really hard in that it's difficult execution. What The problem is 90% of the level is easy, and then there's one hard thing at the end. But you have to do the 90% that's easy bullshit every time you fail at the hard part. That That's not real difficulty. That's just repetitive. And when, when you have a platformer that's basically running to the right the game, and then you make a death wall at the far right of the stage without saying, oh hey, touch your brother, and then you'll finish the stage. That's kind of a dick move. Because it was... Yeah. Um, I'm going to try not to judge the game that bad, that, you know, that significantly over that, because it's just an alpha, and I mean, game design can be pretty broken in alphas, but that is my impression of that level. Um, I'd like to see more of the game. Um... I'm hoping you have more level... I'd love to see more of the level design and the music. Because I think there could be some really cool stuff going on with this game. So, I'll definitely try and keep an eye on it. 